Welcome to the video, my friends. George truly ocho pensamientos on Espanol, on Anglais. That's eight thoughts. Thank you very much for coming on by. I'm not, I'm not Hispanic. I'm not Latino. I'm just talented like that. I just pick up languages because I am a really intelligent person. And uh, apparently, uh, so was Ninja because he got on the 2019 list, as the title says, for most influential people. That's yeah, so okay. Let me just repeat that again because I know people are going to, you know, say, like, yeah, he deserves to be on there. You know, he's a really big deal and all that. I love, I love. Ninja, yeah. Move. If you guys know it, just move. It's all I want to see some movement. I'm not seeing enough movement. But this is the most influential list for 2019. We're not we're not talking 2017, 2018 in his prime. We're talking this is most influential people for 2019. Like, first of all, the fun thing is, is this dude's a Fortnite video game player. And I, I get, so I guess he's influential in the fact that he has 12 and 13 year old kids watching his stream, thinking that they're somehow going to be a professional gamer. So I guess he's influencing little kids to buy V-Bucks. I mean, that's cool. But also for 2019, this makes no sense at all. Shall I show you a graph? I'll show you a graph. Um, okay, as you can see here, his subscriber count uh, has been dropping steadily since about a peak of March 2018, April 2018, May 2018. And then from then on, it has dropped all the way down to 14,981. In fact, there's like, I don't know, 20, 30 people on Twitch that have a bigger and larger subscriber base with more people watching. I mean, Summit 1G, for heaven's sakes, has more people watching him stream GTA 5 role-playing. And if we're just going to stick in the genre of Fortnite, at this point for 2019, Tifu is the bigger and more influential Fortnite gamer, I guess. I don't know. I mean, Ninja has a bunch of corporate stuff behind him, I guess. Red Bull and I don't know what, what else. Uh, tampons, I guess, as well. While we're talking about sponsorships and all, this might be an opportune time for me to mention that, hey guys, make sure that you enter creator code 8 thoughts at the Fortnite store. If you're going to buy anything, help support 8 thoughts because, quite frankly, I'm broke, have no money, I'm going homeless. So enter creator code 8 thoughts and uh, help 8 thoughts make a couple bucks so that I can also, at the same time, look really good while I go through chemo and uh, get hair plugs and look attractive like Ali A. But this list of the top 100 most influential people includes a dweeby, anorexic, stimulant-taking video game player. And like I said, sure, in 2016, 2017, I guess he was influential. But at that time already, like, he's not really influential. It's just, you know, Fortnite was really a popular game, and it became mainstream, and people already played video games, and people have already been making money on Twitch, and people were already, you know, making money on YouTube. People were already making money, making video games. The gaming industry is the biggest industry in the world. It makes more money than any other entertainment industry or any industry in the world as far as, you know, actual money per year. They make billions of dollars. Movies make, you know, not nearly as much. So I'm not really sure what he is influential other than, like I said, getting kids to think they're going to be some professional gamer, get their mommy's credit card, and subscribe with their Twitch and Amazon Prime and link that together and get some V-Bucks and enter creator code. Eight Thoughts. Not Ninja. Dude's a millionaire. He doesn't need any more money. Eight Thoughts does. Also, buy my merch link subscription below. I want to see some movement. I'm not seeing enough movement. I kind of want to seem like a hater because Eight Thoughts is a congratulator. I'm never a hater. So, congratulations to Ninja's success. We're not hating on the dude's success. We're not hating the fact the dude stacked a bunch of money. I mean, I'm not saying I want to be BFF as the guy and hang out and have some beers or have him watch you while I bang his wife. I mean, I don't, I mean, I'm, you know, hey, actually, you know, maybe, maybe, you know. That might be an idea. Okay, I'm not going to cross that one off the list, but just hanging out me and him without his wife, that's not going to happen. <laughs> like I said, though, not hitting on success. Congratulations on all the money he's made. Way to rake it in. Heydays are in the past. Being an influential person in 2019. I mean, how the hell is PewDiePie not on his list? That, that's another gamer who's not on a list. Like, I know I trash PewDiePie all the time, and mostly I really just do it because I like to see all the PewDiePie fanboys get all super upset and, you know what, enter their 10% discount code for Ninja's tampons because they're bleeding because they're a bunch of put. <laughs> but honestly, like Ozzy, why would a guy with 97 million subscribers that is one of the biggest like internet and just like people in the world as far as like people being known and actually having influence, you know, about being a toxic white male, okay? That's another joke, okay? Hey, listen, enter 10% discount code for Ninja's tampons, PewDiePie fanboys. But really though, I mean like it's a, he's a, I mean like if Ninja's gonna be on a list, at least, I mean like, I don't know, how is PewDiePie not on a list? It's just crazy. And also really, most importantly, how, how, 
how am I, like, honestly, how am I not on a list? I am one of the most influential alpha male elite gaming athletes in the world. And me not being on that list is a travesty. I mean, that really is a takeaway from this video. So, I mean, really, let's, let's just, let's just reiterate the important points of this video and what you really should be taking away from it. The first thing, most importantly, is you got to like the video. Okay. That's, that's one thing. Subscribe. Now that's taken care of the next important aspect and the important message of the videos. One, how am I not on the list? I should be on the list. I'm the best. I'm the greatest. And I really appreciate all you guys watching the video. And that really is the important message. The travesty is the eight thoughts. Alpha male elite gaming champion is not on the list. Really? Let's, let's just cut it. Let's just cut right to it. That's the facts, Jack. Thank you for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you check out my Twitch channel. You can subscribe. If you have Amazon prime, you can link that to your Twitch prime and enter creator code eight thoughts. And I will see all of you on the next video. Thank you so very much for watching. Love you, dude. And last but not least, and now I think most importantly, y'all stay black. I didn't speed that up, I just speak that fast. Bring you down.